August 25, 2023. Ukraine war. Approximately nine years and seven months into the invasion of Crimea. Day 548 of Special Putin's operations. Big picture. Heavy combat across the ground contact lines. The Kremlin continues to take children from occupied Ukraine to far east Russia. Kremlin shelling was more broadly spaced than yesterday, when it appeared strikes were only available around ongoing ground offensives by either side. Dnieper line. Shelling was heavy into Kherson. Kremlin mouthpieces claim the downing of Ukrainian frogfoot. Zaporizhia front. Minor advances recorded for Ukraine around Robotine. Kremlin cannon fodder was repulsed around Vuladar. Ukraine could use a few good strikes on some ammunition right about now. The Kremlin is using aviation heavily east of the Morky Yoli. East front, Donetsk. The Kremlin appears to have made serious attempts to break the bulge at Novomykolivka. At Marienka the Kremlin attacks were repelled. Near Pervomaysk more Kremlin attacks were repelled. Bakhmut area. In another attempt to steal Klishchivka, the Kremlin sent an unsuccessful attack wave, which was forced to flee. The remainder of this area did not see any ground fighting, except for shelling. Oskil border front. Ukrainian troops again repulsed attacks at Novoyharivka. Air strikes and artillery by the Kremlin were aimed at over 34 settlements. Kremlin mouthpieces and Ukrainian official sources conflict over further attacks in the last day. According to at least one Kremlin source, six attacks were made from Svartov north to Sinkivka, which their maps clearly show as still Ukrainian, despite proclamations of capture last week. It must be noted, however that the Kremlin's troops are claiming they have been making minor successes day by day. If so, the fighting must be extremely fierce, as their claimed progression in mostly open fields is 500 feet per day. One Kremlin mouthpieces claims that Kremlin attacks at Kupiasenk are a payment for some other battle. Since Ukraine had to go to the invaders to kill them, it is nice of the soon-to-be-dead invaders to come to the Ukrainians, so they don't have to search for the criminals. Northern border. Shelling across this border from the Kremlin's criminals was extremely spaced. The exception was in eastern Sumy, where it appears there may have been an artillery duel. Kremlin air defense forces claim to have downed a drone in Kaluga Arblast. Black Sea. The Kremlin has 10 warships in the Black Sea. Currently the patrolling fleet has a total available salvo of 8 caliber missiles. Ukraine hit military targets in occupied Crimea. Ukraine world related. Putin will not be attending G20 in India. Lukashenko has distanced himself from the Prigozhin assassination, stating that he was never asked for any guarantees. Finland is sending another 94 million euro worth of classified military aid for Ukraine. Lithuania is sending another 41 million euros worth of munitions, small arms, and electronic warfare tools. We aim to bring more. Like and subscribe.